Talk 365's Small Talk is made possible by University Credit Union. All right, everybody, we found Mike and Cowboy Cauldron and Todd. This, yeah. this is the original cauldron. Isn't that cool? It's super cool. Mike, I'm so excited to hear your story because <laughs> you were from all over the place. Yep. And I just want to understand how you came to owning a business and why University Credit Union and why cauldrons. Okay, so great question. So I left here uh -huh. and went to Washington, D.C. and became staff counsel to the banking committee for a number of years and then became a lobbyist and represented financial services institutions. And one of the things I learned about being counsel to the banking committee is that if you're not at a credit union, you're an idiot. Because I, I think we can just call I it. I wish a day. I could put that on a That was amazing. Yeah. yeah. I mean from the legal perspective, from the fees perspective, from every perspective that makes any difference at all credit unions are the place that anyone should be and now that credit unions are legally allowed to do business lending as soon as that was the case I moved my business to the University Credit Union. That's amazing and yep. tell me how you found the Cowboy Cauldron. So as a lobbyist I was entertaining for a living as you might surmise and I was also fortunate enough to be living on the grounds at Mount Vernon which is George Washington's home. Oh, wow. He also entertained for a living when he wasn't running the country or running a war. Hmm. I am a firebug and I'm also a very avid hunter. And so I was living in this wonderful place and thinking to myself, Mike, come on, you got we need a fireplace. We need something that's beautiful, portable, that's versatile, that is gonna want people are gonna want to spend time around. Mm -hmm. And because I had all things colonial around me had lots of good things to draw from and came up with this. So this is the original wow, piece. This, is this awesome. was actually manufactured to my specs by a mining equipment repairman. Uh -huh. um, and I had to move it home from his shop in a Volvo 240 station wagon. <laughs> nice. So you can, that ages me a little bit, but you know, hey. And it just became an instant hit among the, probably say the, the cognoscenti, if you will. Um, in my part of the political world and then when I left my buddies saw it here and said Mike that thing is so cool make us one please mm -hmm. which of course I said no way <laughs> so I'm hard. not doing that <laughs> <laughs> they're hard make your own uh -huh. um, but eventually two of them prevailed upon me and I made a couple and literally a week later I got a call from a guy in New York hey you the cauldron guy Sure, why not? Who are you? <laughs> and there you go. And that's how it started. Wow. Yep. That is awesome. So how many are you making? Where are you having them manufactured? And how do we how do we get them? They are made right here in Salt Lake City, mm -hmm. for the most part. There are some machining requirements that don't exist here, as you might guess. We did a million dollars in sales last year. We'll probably double that this year. Congratulations. So yeah, the, growth, the growth has been pretty remarkable. And right now, I'm essentially in the middle of a classic MBA growth management project. They're all made of U.S. steel, which we're really proud of, and uh, hopefully we can keep it that way as the growth continues. So how did you come across the University Credit Union? Well, when I moved back to Utah, I was a Sigma Chi here at the University. I've always had a great affinity for the U. We moved into this neighborhood near the University and thought, what credit unions for me? I know. Crimson red. Nice. Mm -hmm. so. <laughs> what color is your card? That's right. right. That's Always red. red. That's right. So, I mean, these things, it's a fire pit. You can cook on it. It is so versatile. Just sit around it. And I think in Utah, more than anywhere, it's got to be a huge hit in Park City and all of the resort towns to have in the backyard to be able to go warm yourself up after yep. skiing and the snow. I mean, I, I think it's, it's such a clever idea. The beautiful thing about these is that they are versatile for starters. We have chefs all over the world now who use them. You can cook wow. inside them, you can grill on them, you can put the fire underneath and use it as the world's maybe largest soup pot, if you will. <laughs> wow. Um, we just did uh, installations for the Four Seasons in both Kona and Maui. Wow. They're doing some really exciting things with them, and we're yeah. asked to appear at food festivals all over the country, uh -huh. certainly, and increasingly all over the world. 
That great. is so cool. Well, Mike, thank you for taking a minute to talk to us and for endorsing and talking to us about how you found University Credit Union, because we, of course, love them. And I love small business owners. I love the entrepreneurial spirit, and yours is definitely strong and you're like succeeding congratulations thank you so very much that is just you're like the best story we could get um and what can we just load this into the truck for me then because knock yourself that's, out that's what we decided <laughs> yeah, right? lift that, Holly. yeah actually they're not that the two of us could easily do it <laughs> but i'd prefer to feed back the truck out. tell us where we can get one what do we need to do if we want to get one uh cowboycauldron.com uh we ship them directly to your home via a scheduled delivery service and yeah, get one hey, sooner or later. Cauldron Envy is real. Don't let it happen to you. <laughs> Mike, thank you for talking to us. You're so welcome.